Hello everyone. Today I'm going to talk about partial anomalous coronary venous return imaging. So we can call partial anomalous coronary venous return in case of one to see pulmonary vein train into systemic vein or right atrium, left to right shunt. More common sign and symptom, frequently asymptomatic if only one anomalous pulmonary vein return. Symptom related to shunt's some sun sign, sign like dyspnea, palpitation, chest pain, tachycardia, edema, systolic normal. Top differential analysis persistent left superior vena cava may simulate radical vein, often associated with dilated coronary sinus, left superior pulmonary vein posterior to left atrial appendix, lateralization of aortic pulmonary reflection, mediastinal lipomatosis, partial anomalous pulmonary vein return with the vein, Position left superior vena cava, mediastinal lung cardinopathy, lung cancer. Best diagnostic tool: direct drainage of pulmonary vena into superior vena cava, inferior vena cava, right atrium or left branchial cephalic pump. Location. I'm going to location like left up below most common up to 47%, left up below and right up below around 38%, right lower below 13%, left lower below. 2%. Frequently normal in the radiology or radiography, left upper lobe, partial anomalous pulmonary when I return, vertical vein may cause lateralization of chaotic pulmonary reflection. If significant shunt, we can find cardiomegaly, right heart enlarge, pulmonary artery enlargement, increased number and size of pulmonary vessel, shunt vascularity. This PA cheradigraph of the patient with left upper lobe partial anomalous pulmonary venous return, so soft tissue, lateral to the aortic arch. And lateralization of the aortic pulmonary reflection, a subtle yet abnormal finding. This PA cheradigraph of a case and beat left upper low partial anomalous pulmonary venous return. So, obturation of the aortic arch due to the presence of a chest and vertical vein.
Of the PAPVR, middle lobe pulmonary vein also typically involved, drain into superior venical vein occasionally in acicose vein, right atrium, inferior venical vein, hepatic vein, or portal vein, often associated with sinus venous address of the defects, rarely with osseum primum ASD. Right lower lobe, PAPVR, Simetan syndrome, right below lobe, occasional middle, and or upper lobe pulmonary vein, drain into inferior vena cava, may drain directly into right atrium, right, when associated with sinus venous ASD. Bilateral upper lobe, PAPVR, uncommon, or as an case, if significant left to right channel, right head, you can find right head large, pulmonary artery more than three centimeter in diameter. Axillary finding, persistent left superior vena cava, acicose constitution of inferior vena cava. Composite imaging with axial contrast and CT of the, the, of the patient. So the vertical line, why should it at all? Course, lateral to the aortic arch. Not absent of left superior pulmonary line from its normal location. Anterior to the left main stem focus and posterior to the left material appendage. Curve coronal, coronal contrast enhancing to reform image of this, the patient. So, a vertical vein lies with arrow indicate. Then the race from segmental lack of pulmonary vein to drain into the ipsilateral lack branchial cephalic vein by curve arrow. Go or not contrast and hence CT 3D SSD reformatic image of the patient. So the left upper lobe atrial of anomalous pulmonary venous return, wisely narrow, the most common form of partial anomalous pulmonary venous return in the left amygdala. When isolated, the left to right shunt is small and hypotonic asymptomatic. 
CTA on IP image of the set of the patient. So let upload P A P V I dining into what the government. It should be distinguished from persistent left superior rear vena cava in which left superior pulmonary vein cause anterior to the left main stem bronchi and posterior to the left arterial appendix. Axial CTA of a patient with a right upper lobe PA, PVR, and sinus venous atrial septal effect. So anomalous drainage of the right upper lobe, pulmonary vein, wisely narrow into superior vena cava. Axial CTA of the patient, so the sinus venous ASD, black arrow. Note that the middle low pulmonary vines, wise solid arrow, train in di uh, directly to the right atrium and contribute to the lacturation. The association with sinus venous as ASD is typically seen in the follow PRP below. Axial CTA, a patient so enlarged of the right hand chamber and inversion of interventricular septum consistent with increased right hand pressure secondary to a significant left to right shine. Axial CTA. So a sinus venous AST and a right low low pulmonary vein that train into the left atrium and contribute to the lacturation produced by the sinus venous AST. Curve coronal CT MIP. Reformat image of the, the patient so left upper lobe and right upper lobe pulmonary vine that train it into the left pressure separate vine and superior area vena cava respectively. Some of my finding MRI equivalent to CT for characterization on PA, PBR, MR superior to CT for identifying and identification of ASD, all ocean quantification. Composite image with axial MRI, so bilateral. Up follow PA PVI. Not to level vertical vine and direct drainage into uh, drainage of the sub up follow pulmonary vine into superior vanagawa. For chamber view of SSFP sign compound of the of a patient so dilate, dilation of the right heart chamber and flatten of the interventricular septum in keeping with a significant lacturation, cardiac number allow quantification of the sun with velocity encoded imaging. Corona anterior 3D reconstruction of the um, RA of the, of the patient. So the vertical vine into which all left upper pulmonary vine branch drain. 
Corona posterior 3D reconstruction of the compound A of the patient show the right upper row pulmonary vein draining into the superior vena cava, while PAPVO is often asymptomatic. Symptom may be arise in direct proportion to the amount of blood being shunted as in this patient with bilateral PAPVI. Echocardiographic finding. Echocardiography frequently diagnostic, consider cardiac compound or CT for equivalent cases. Image A, suprastenal echocardiographic view. OSPV, right superior pulmonary vein, blue arrow and right middle pulmonary vein, right arrow. Connecting to superior vena cava by a peer junction. B. Subcostal sagittal echocardiography video. So the superior SVD, ASD, arrow indicate SVC. C. Parastinal subaxis echocardiography video. There was no posterior inter. Atrial subtal rim between ASD and possibly atrial bone. D. Multiplana reconstruction of multi detector CT show right superior pulmonary venous connected to SVC right atrial junction. Absent of posterior rim of ASD was also observed. Treatment, surgical correction may be indicated for symptomatic PA, PBR, and or QP should have a ratio more than, ratio more than 2 to 1, vascularing, consistent, coexistent, congenital heart disease. Thank you.